Hey everybody, sorry for taking so long to make another video about Starlink. I've had it over a month now, probably a little longer than that. Just a lot of things going on. Real estate business picked up quite a bit too. So as you can see, I have placed it right here on a stump for the time being. And I'll show you a screenshot of what it says. My obstruction says it's obstructed every five minutes. I think that's right. And actually it's not, it's pretty good. I get speeds of averaging 120 to 160 average. I've seen it as high as 250 and my uh, uploads been averaging 15 to 30. So it's been pretty good. Now, I didn't start there. I actually started as a little area right here that I started, I put it on the table. No, actually I started on the ground and that didn't work as well. And I moved it over here for a period of time. That didn't work as well. Then I put it right back here on a table, trying to get a clear spot because you can't tell it, but I have trees right here. And with the app, it's, it remind it tells you where to locate it. And I'll, I'll put one, I'll add it to the video showing you how, where and how to loca locate your dish so that you can get the best reception, like I say. I've got it there and it says it's supposed to be intermittent every five minutes. It, it has not. Uh, I'm Like I say, I'm getting speeds. I can watch HD on my TV. Like I say, it's also uh, unlimited for now, which I am in beta. So, and we're still switching back from here to Sandy's mom's over the chicken houses. And I, at one time I thought AT&T &T fixed wireless was real good. It's just good compared to this. I actually can do a lot of work. And I one guy asked me to do a Zoom on it and I haven't had a chance to do it yet. I've tried to get them one this week so that people can see that the Zoom works well. And I, I don't see it being a problem, but he asked, so I'll, I'll try to get him one on YouTube so he can see what it's like. Now I will say it has been, I've, I've enjoyed it. Now I, I've, finally started using it more and more over here. Like I say, Sandy's mom's not in the greatest health, so she's over there. She got to come over today. Now, you can put several people, I, I would love to be able to tell you how far you can go away from your home area because my understanding is it's hooked to a satellite or, or a fixed location, even though they all in the sky that you can get reception. So, like I say, man, it, this here is, to me, I, I, if you live in the country, I understand some of them, you know, talking about fixed wireless, nah, it's okay. Some of them's getting DSL. This here, I mean, you're talking, the average is 150. Every time I check, it's 150. Yeah, it may go out a couple seconds. You sit there and then it comes back in and then you, you don't have a problem with it for 30 minutes maybe. So, but like I say, I wanted to do a quick update. I will put some uh, screenshots of my speeds in with, with this, one of my cats, and show so you can see what it's like. I also will show the app for Starlink so that you can see, and like I say, and then there's Bruce. I have four cats. So, and I will, like I say, try to put things in there so people can tell what is, what, if it's really working. And it is really working. And my understanding, every week or every month, they're putting up more and more satellites. And it's just going to get better and better. Uh, I have one lady that is supposed to close next week and she couldn't close because she's got to have internet she couldn't get starlink soon enough so she's going with another one huge net i'm sure she will go with starlink just as soon as it gets there because like i said it's a hundred dollars a month however you unlimited right now you can't beat that huge net's not unlimited uh, none of them exceed none of them's unlimited so like i say i will put add some others in here so you can see what I'm getting here, I haven't taken over to Sandy's mom's. Actually, I think as long as you keep it stationary, 
that's what I've had for the last couple weeks. Well, last week anyway. I've had it stationary, and my TV's been just, you know, my internet's been great. Now, let's see if I can get this going right. Well, you see it says obstructions. Check for obstructions. I don't really see how it is because it is what it is. So, what I'm going to do is go back. No, it says checking for instructions. You can also do this at the beginning. You don't have instructions, but anyway. So you see, I've got my satellite, and it says install your satellite link where it has nothing but blue sky. You see, I've got little trees here, and I should have a little trees here. I'm actually thinking about putting it out a little bit further in the pasture. So that's where you want to install it. And like I say, right now I'm getting pretty pretty good speeds so hopefully that'll help me anybody that's looking at purchasing it all right everybody i'm sorry it took so long to make another video i will do another update here before long because there's a lot of things that's happening with starlink and it's still a hundred dollars a month unlimited and the speeds are getting on up there I've actually got them, some of them recorded 200, I've even hit 250, and still up, that's the download, upload, still 15 to 30, so still not bad. Like I said, I've got 200 now. I do believe that it's better if you keep try to keep it in one spot, I will say that. But again, I hate, it took me forever to get this video put together, and I'm going to make another one pretty quick about what, what, what else is going on, what I see with Starlink. No, I don't know at all. So I hope this helps every, anybody that is interested in the Starlink. I know it's a lot of people in the country that do not have Starlink or do not have internet that would love to have Starlink. And I trust me, I do believe you can do about anything you want to with this uh, internet here. It, it, to me, it's, it's amazing compared to what I've had in the past. So y'all have a good one.